This morning, friends of a Campbellsville firefighter who was injured in the line of duty and later died are working to raise money for a project to honor his life and legacy. As Lauren Adams reports in this WLKY exclusive, they're seeing to it that Captain Tony Greider is remembered with a statue in his likeness. Here you go. We're taking it up for Tony Greider. We appreciate y'all's support. Every donation, every dollar is one step closer to remembering much, a firefighter and a friend. God bless. It was August 21st, Captain Tony Grider was helping the Campbellsville University marching band with the ALS Ice Bucket Challenge. He was electrocuted when the bucket he was in got too close to high voltage power lines, and he died one month later. Kenny Anderson, who trained Grider to become a firefighter, says it's clear people haven't forgotten him. They'll give a dollar, maybe just a handful of change, but they have that giving spirit, and that's what it's all about. That's what Tony was, was a giving spirit. Thank you very much. Brad Schofner worked alongside Grider at the Campbellsville Fire Department. He's organizing the sale of t-shirts and asking for donations so that a statue can be created in his friend's honor. Thank you. Strangers. Do you know Tony? I know, but I'm from Campbellsville. And family are grateful. The mom broke down in tears. She said, this is no, you couldn't honor my son no better way than this. It will be placed in the lobby of the Taylor County Hospital. Grider, also a paramedic, was a fixture there, so friends say it's fitting. That's where it needs to go. I mean, that, that'll look good. Uh, Every time you go into the ER on a run and to see that statue there, kind of bring back some memories, maybe some good ones. Memories of a man that dedicated two decades to serving his community and paid the ultimate price. This is something that's going to show that, yes, there was a man out there that laid his life out every day to help people and that he was appreciated. Lauren Adams, WLKY News. The statue will cost $4,000. A glass case costs an additional $1,000. Any other money raised will go to Grider's family. If you're interested in contributing, just head to our website, WLKY.com, and click on a link to the story.